down by the pretty red flowers. There we go. Hello, hello, <laughs> and welcome to the show. Hey, everybody. So, we actually started recording earlier, but guess what? My well. audio wasn't working. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and start again. Uh, as you would have missed, this is my Unbreaking 3 Efficiency 3 pick. And I pretty much wore it out, and you will see why here in just a second. But the parts you just missed was me finishing up my levels to make another pick. And I got, I put 20 levels on it, and I was looking for something similar to that. And, ta-da! Efficiency 3, I'm breaking 3. So, for anybody who's That's playing that... That's a cute little pick you got there. Yeah, shut up. For anybody who's <laughs> playing the uh, Xbox version, uh, if you want a good working pick... 20 levels, 21 levels seems to be a good spot. Go ahead, hon. For example, Glow. go ahead. At 21 levels, the enchanting table that likes me better than him gave me an efficiency 3, unbreaking 3. Oh, and silk touch one. It's just not fair. It's it's Did it's, I just throw it at you? It's just not fair. No. No, okay, I moved it. <laughs> I was like it's not in my inventory anymore. What did I do? <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at what we've been doing inside. I know that I promised I'd have a whole bunch of this done, but that is not going to be the case. <laughs> um, and we'll tell you why here as we go down. But first, I think we should pray to the torch of life. Oh, great this torch one? of life. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Please hit life me with hit your you. bounty. Uh, Please you know, show us I, the way to your holy world. I'm sick of holding the torch of life. I'm going to put it down right here. Ta-da! <laughs> That's right, guys. We have a secret entrance. And uh, we'll show you how that works here in just a second. But first, I thought we'd show you where the the nether portal's going to go. Oh, this is going to be good for the portal. I like that it's hidden here. and it's Yeah. Hmm. Is that big enough for a portal? Mm, you don't think that's big enough? All right, big let's go bigger. Bigger. Bigger? Bigger, bigger. Bigger? My, my. I may have bigger, bigger for you. Ooh, my, my. my, my. <laughs> That's right, guys. Ooh. From what you see, wall to wall, and if you look down here, um, as best I can, that goes all the way down to bedrock. We're at level 33 all the, all the right here. We're going down to level 3. The floor will all be the, made the floor, of huh? bedrock and um, obsidian. And the nether portal will be hanging from the center of this room. That's right, I said this hanging. This going to be so awesome. Hanging. So, if you take a look over here and get an idea of what my plans are, you look through here and see all the dimensions, see how far back everything goes. This is the plan, is to have stuff like that all the way around this room. And this will completely be hollowed out. It's going to be a lot of work, but man, oh man, is it going to be cool. The concept of this area was basically like we laid out. There'd be like a, a deity or something that people worshipped. Well, I figured I'd make rooms for the worshippers, right? I mean, I want this room. This one's my room. Alrighty. I don't know if you looked in the chests or not, but this is the one that has a diamond door in it. Oh. So I want this room. <laughs> uh, so basically making rooms like this, because this is what you know a monk would need, is books. A chest and a bed. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna continue on with this, but uh, before we get back to continuing on, let's go head up to the stairs real quick, and we'll show you where that torch was placed. Um, you may have noticed that there was what looked like forges in the ground in some patterns. There's also this right here, which if you know the blocks well enough, you know that those are pistons because forges and um, oh shoot, I just broke that one. I'll have to fix it. Pistons and what's the other one? Dispensers? Forges and dispensers have the little half yeah. slab at the bottom. They have like a little metal thing on the bottom of them. So basically what all you got to do to make those doors open and close is pop that off. And to give you a better look of how that works as I fix my mistake, I am going to uh, head over to the test world in a cut. And we will be back with you in just a bit. Here we are in the test world. And uh, this is the basic principles I used. Um, 
as I said, I'm not going to do a tutorial on this or anything, but figured I'd give you a go at what it is. So if you look at the inside, those are obviously pistons because of the backs of them, but you can't really tell what's going on. So the concept is you replace the, one of the sides with the torch, with a um, redstone torch, and that opens up. There you go. And basically what you got over here is white line is the wall and the blue line is the stairs. And to make it work since basically when they're off when the pistons are in the blue line is active when the pistons are out the white line is active so you need a delay in the white line to make it so that the walls wait long enough for the stairs to retract so that's what this is basically when you turn that off you got this additional line that goes around and keeps this active for for longer and that's how it works um hopefully that's enough to uh show you if you want to try to do it at home there's plenty of tutorials out there and there's probably much easier ways to do this so all right let's get back to the other world putting my pick in here sweetheart it's my pick okay my pick. I know it's not as good as your, your pick. I don't but want it's your still my silly pick. old pick. My picks are better. I don't want your pick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys. Welcome back to the Let's Play world. And uh, hopefully that was a good enough explanation for you. I know that it doesn't show you really how to build it, but I don't think I'm good <laughs> with the tutorial stuff. So, well. Considering the fact that you don't just go, okay, and I'm going to place this here and this here and this here. You know, you actually figure it out because you're not watching tutorials yourself to do it. You're just well figuring it out. So. And I'm not uh, savvy on the technical battle of it either, so. <laughs> so You're better than I am. Uh, true enough. <laughs> that's, not, that's not saying a lot. <laughs> I was like, I don't know what know, to say about that, but okay. <laughs> I know how to place some redstone in a line. That's about it. <laughs> Um, anyway, while we got you here, we're going to start working on some stuff in here and do our regular thing. Um, we're going to start digging down and whatnot. I think we're going to actually need to go find some lava this episode as well. But uh, I had something I wanted to talk to you guys about. Uh, something that happened to me earlier. Uh, I guess it will be last week by the time this airs. Um, I was bringing my are going to pick up my son from school and stopped at a stop sign and my car went kerthunk and I took off and it was making a whole bunch of racket. I was like, oh, oh, I broke something. So I decided to start heading back for home since I was closer to home than I was to the school. And uh, it's a good thing I did because guess what? What? Wait, I already know. <laughs> An engine mount completely broke. Completely broke. So one of the three engine mounts broke, and the engine fell down on that side and hit the axle on that side. Uh, Front-wheel drive Volkswagen Golf, 1990 Golf. Bent the, bent the axle, I'm pretty sure. Tore the boot, I know for sure. Something that, you know, is like an $80 part to replace ends up being over 300 Now, here's the kicker. I only paid $1,400 for the vehicle. I don't want to spend $300 in parts to fix the thing. So, <laughs> Especially because you don't like it anyway. Yeah, not really, no. So, yeah, I might just have to junk it. Um, I really don't know what I'm going to do for sure on that, but it is what it is, you know. It is what it is. It is. Sucky is what it is. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're going to get to work here, and uh, 
will cover cover anything entertaining and uh, important as usual. Hey, babe. Huh? I just found the cave system over here. Oh yeah. Uh, we've already been in it, but oh. I'm thinking maybe we can find some, some lava? lava or some water. Or not oh, some water, some obsidian <laughs> that we've already turned to to okay. take care of down here. Do you want to spend some time doing that for a minute? See if we can find anything. Sure. Absolutely. Um, I'm assuming we're gonna have to move down versus up, so stuff doesn't. But if I come to any any choices. <laughs> yeah, if if you have the choice to go up or down, I guess down would be the the preferred way to go. So what you're saying is if I have a choice, you want me to go down. What the heck? I'm getting some kind of weird block lag going on here. Uh-oh. Well, oh, it's nice for a change that you're getting the lag instead of me. <laughs> I mean, from my perspective, anyway. Yeah. Oh, wait. I just got it, too. See? See what happens when I try to make fun of you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. The game just shuts me down. <laughs> That's weird. Ready? So there's that. Alright, let's go find another section. How much obsidian do you think we're gonna need? Oh, for what I got planned, we're gonna need a lot. Uh oh. Got epic plans is? I do. Yeah, don't stay down there. Stay down there. Shut up. Call <laughs> me in. It's like that Ed Girl and Poe book, the Telltale Heart. Yeah, you're, you're... Call me up inside something. You're already over my head there. I've already lost you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's my pick. Aw, oh, man. Wait. It just came back. Again? What? How's it... What? Wait. That's not right. Okay, now it's gone. Is it sure this time? I don't know. Yep, looks like is, it. Okay, is the block that you used to hit it with still gone? Mmm, coffee. Tasty, tasty. Mmm, wine. Way better. Yeah, yeah. Wine is nothing <laughs> but acid in my stomach, man, I tell you. But it tastes so yummy. I, I will agree with you that certain wines taste yummy. I prefer reds, personally. Me too. That's what I'm drinking. But, mmm, coffee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, tell you what, looking at that coffee cup, got a Yoda coffee cup here that I've had for year. I want to say it's as old as our son, so seven, seven <laughs> years or so. Yeah. It's got. It's a, a porcelain, you know, fired style coffee cup, and it's got chips out of it, and the coating is coming off of the pictures, and it used to be a glow-in-the-dark yeah. Yoda th Jedi coffee mug. Jedis don't need caffeine. They have the force. Yeah, it's all those midi-chlorians. Oh my gosh! Did you see... Okay, um, have you... you? I don't know if you've heard, there was um, some group that was petitioning the U.S. government to make a Death Star. Yes, I saw the post on that today. On... Did you see that? Yeah. The, the the official response was amazing. It was. It was pretty funny. If, if you guys like, at home wait. have a chance to, to see that, you need to check it out. There's, there was a petition to make a Death Star. It had like 32,000 signatures on it. And the science department for the, for the White House... Um, actually put out a, a response for it. It was pretty entertaining. A hilarious response. <laughs> I was like, wait, how did somebody in government grow a sense of humor? I don't believe it. <laughs> well, you know, that's that's part of the new generation thing, you know? I mean, True. we've talked about this before. Um, it seems like the older generation has ran the country f for a very, very long time, and it's finally the the internet generation that's going to be uh, in charge of the of the country and you know there's a lot of haters right now with the whole obama thing being uh the tax 
what not the cut not being brought brought back but Obama was the first president that that understood what Twitter actually was like I'm not saying that other presidents hadn't tried to use Facebook or Twitter or whatnot well Twitter wasn't around uh, so it'd be like MySpace uh, but Obama was the first person that actually uses it I remember uh, yeah. when uh, Bill Clinton when Bill Clinton went on like the Leno show and stuff like that playing the saxophone seemed like he was trying really hard to to you know I'm, I'm, a, I'm a I'm a young crowd guy you know you guys gotta like me you know but and he tried and he meant well, but he just he just didn't get it. He just didn't have it. <laughs> no. It's almost better at that point to be like W. Bush where you're you're a little bit off and you can blame it on the fact that you're old. <laughs> now as for our political views, uh that's not ever gonna be coming up on here because quite frankly It's none of your business. Oh wait, sorry, that probably not was not what you meant to say. <laughs> <laughs> well that's true too, but it's it's just a matter of too many arguments i mean there's wars been started over politics and i tell you what anybody watching this anybody listening right now if you want to have a happy life there's one thing you do not do you do not bring up politics it doesn't matter if it's a family member gathering it doesn't matter (laughs) if it's a friend uh over for dinner just don't bring up politics there's plenty of other things to talk about in the world and you may share the same political views as as uh your friends and family but you know what it's a lot easier to find to not find out so that's just my <laughs> my take on the thing wow i just found like a perfectly circular room it that is. is weird so maybe this was already an altar of some sort and well, we're this just totally looks remaking like one. it wow all right well i found another cave system i'm gonna check it out and see if i can find more lava okay it's funny i was talking with uh Gary. Today at the my cousin's baby shower, mm-hmm. and uh, she she said something. Uh, I, I said something about um, about our son, and she's like, "Yeah, I have these friends that have a three year old. Well, I mean, they're not really my friends, but they're they're people that I I I listen to their podcast and I've tweeted with them a few times." And she like started to go into the whole explanation of how she quote unquote knows these people, and everybody else in the room is just staring at her, and I'm like. I totally get what you're talking about. Because, <laughs> you know, I mean, this is like all oh, my great aunt and her mom and, just, you know, it's people who just don't even know what the internet is for. And Carrie and I are totally talking about how we don't ever watch TV. All we watch is YouTube. And <laughs> it was just funny, you know, just complete difference in lifestyle and terminology and everything. Just, it's it's generation gap. I mean, you know. Absolutely. I mean, what it comes down to on that front is basically, yes, there are people from uh, older generations, and I'm not saying my parents, I'm saying older generations, that understand how to use the Internet. There's, they, they work, you know, in fields related to it or what have you. I'm not saying that they don't get it. I'm saying they don't get it. I'm saying that right. It's like they they may understand it, but they don't understand the complete difference in in lifestyle. And yes. Just... I can hear lava bubbling around me, and I'm just about done with this one. So the wall has a big hole in it that goes into a cave system. Do anything about that, or uh, just ignore? It? One sec. I'm just about done with this. I'm gonna come back up there because. I have over a stack of obsidian, and although I'm going to need more, I can only, only, uh... Waste so much pick on it. It's just boring. <laughs> oy, oy, oy. <laughs> I tell you folks, if you ever thought that I wasn't legit, there you go. <laughs> you didn't just make them watch you get obsidian, did you? Yep, I'm going to put that whole really, thing on there. No. <laughs> that's really trolly. <laughs> Super trolly. I'm not doing that. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get this lava in here without killing myself. Anybody taking bets? <laughs> I'm not, because I know better. <laughs> hmm. I don't know how 
this is gonna work here. Hey, babe. Yeah. Let's do some some teamwork on this, cause I don't think I'm gonna be able to pull it off otherwise. Okay. Um, lost some stuff, so okay. Um, where do you need me? What do you need me to do? Right over here. I'm here. All right, so I'm gonna have you dig out that block from underneath me, okay? Okay. You got a shovel? Yeah. You're good. Yep. How All can right. you want me to do it? I'll tell you when, okay? okay. I just have it highlighted. Ready? Mm-hmm. Now. Oh, sorry. Whew. Didn't know if you wanted to do I both got ones it. or not. I got it. Oh. Look at, look at. And it's already dripping it? through. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Alright, baby, you gonna be ready again? Uh, yeah, in just a moment. Bye bye. <laughs> That's it for today. Right. I'm out. Bye bye. You ready? Yup. Alright, I'm gonna pop, go. Pop, pop. I am yup. Now. Oh yeah, we're getting <laughs> awesome at this. We are so good. This Just don't fall down yeah. that big hole and die. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm doing that. <laughs> Playing that game. <laughs> Just for you guys to know, while we were not recording, we both fell in that hole twice. Yep. <laughs> And died. <laughs> All right, you ready? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now. Awesome. You make <laughs> a good team, we do. We do at that. If you would like. I'm, I'm, oh, sh <laughs> Uh Yeah, I'm definitely getting tired. <laughs> Doing okay in there? Yeah. <laughs> I just tried to cook myself. Uh, Don't cook yourself. That's bad. Yeah. I think it's pumpkin hour. <laughs> Alright, guys. I'm about done with this here project. And uh, as promised, we're going to go ahead and make a nether portal. Um, this will not be the... The... Uh, long-term positioning for the nether portal but I said we're going to the nether we're going to the nether wrap this bad That's boy how up that works uh, but give you a look here what's going on you can see the dripping through the the floor here or the floor the ceiling wow I'm tired <clears throat> um I wanted to add some kind of a light in there and some kind of a texture thing into the center. This is what's going to be like the base of what's holding up the the nether portal. Um, as I said, it was going to be hanging from the center, so I think it turned out pretty good. Uh, Rain hasn't seen it yet, but so I got I have not seen it. source blocks of lava at each of those locations, and then uh, I'm sure some of it made on 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 video here but we added some more in <laughs> little passageways in here to give some more drippy drippy because it looks cool watch out for the drippy drippy hey now that sounds terrible <laughs> <laughs> you just must have a dirty mind because it wasn't meant to be terrible at all all right babe why don't you go ahead and light it up first Wanna trip to the nether are we ready i'm going first going fall into lava and to die oh wow i didn't know how close, close i was to that oh my gosh <laughs> man that's a lot of lavas man oh well you know it makes sense though because we're right on the edge of the map so we're right in the edge of the nether yes right? so if you see this here 
same thing as bedrock. Um, they make a bedrock wall at the edge of the nether. Oh, gas! Well, apparently there's a gas that once started on us dead. Let me uh, get my bow out here. You happen to have some water on you? Oh, I've got water. Yeah, on but it Never doesn't mind. work in the nether. Oh, dang it! I forget it. Some glitchy, get him? glitchy, glitchy. There's two of them already. I can't get them where they're I at. I don't even see them. I'm gonna hide in the bedrock. <laughs> Man, they are glitchy. Oh, man. Yeah, they are. Just had one totally in my sights, and it just isn't there anymore. Lame. All right, one's down. My my nether is still spawning. I mean, like it, some glowstone just appeared. Yeah, the the multi is not handling it too well. I think we've been playing too long. Oh, yeah, it's not liking it. Hey. Oh, I fell into, into it. <laughs> into what? The lava? Oh, the flame, no. We are terrible at this, man. We don't know we how to so play this noob. game. We are so noob. save as he I dies. Got it, got it. <laughs> Let's go ahead and jump back through the other side. Okay. Hey, we went to the nether. We did not. We did. Alright. Didn't do anything, though. My arrow. So as we hop back to the overworld, we're going to wrap this one up, guys. <clears throat> I plan on... I'm planning on doing a lot of work on this off camera because it's a lot of just tedious, boring stuff, and <laughs> uh, it kind of bores it. It kind of not bores us out, but what am I trying to say? It's you zone out a bit. <laughs> zone out, yeah. So it doesn't make for it's good hard. entertainment for anybody. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoy what we're doing here. If you have any suggestions or comments on this, go ahead and leave them down below for us. As usual, don't forget that like and subscribe. Uh, happy to have finally made it to the, the nether there, Rain. Yes, absolutely. So excited. 